Hello students out there, my name is Michael Sanchez. Today this video is for all you white belters out there. We're going to be talking about holding the violin, making sure that you're doing that correctly. It's really important to, to have the correct accessories in place and to have a good concept of holding the violin correctly. So the first thing I want to talk about is a shoulder rest. A shoulder rest is a very important part of holding the violin correctly. Now without a shoulder rest, it makes it to where it's uncomfortable to really rely on your shoulder and chin to hold the violin which is basically going to make you hold the violin more with your left arm instead of holding it up here. Now the reason for this, that you want to hold it up here, is because eventually later on we're going to want to move our hand back and forth and also do things like vibrato, moving the, the fingers to make a, a, a really nice sound. So we're going to want a nice structure of us holding it here. So these really help with that. Uh, shoulder rest you can get basically online or there's a lot of different places music stores, you can get these. So I'm going to put the shoulder rest on. Have you guys take a look at it. So here's the way the shoulder rest looks on the violin. Now it's a lot more comfortable for me to hold it up here with no hands. So practice holding it with no hands like this. Now you notice that my violin is about 45 degrees to the left of me. I find students do this a lot. They have it way too off the side. And with that, it makes it hard to get to the tip of the bow, which we're going to talk about in some future videos. So make sure that you have about 45 degrees, like this, and that you're able to hold it with no hands. Very good. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video on, on holding the violin. We're going to have a lot more white belt videos in the future. So please tune in and look forward to seeing you guys in the next lesson.